Thanks, Josh. Such an important need. Another need right now, mental health. Advocates across the state fear withheld funding could mean people in need of help might not be getting it. News Channel Line's Rob Hackford says providers like Helio Health in Syracuse were notified at the end of last month. The withheld funds totaling $5.5 million affect dozens of mental health and addiction care services across New York, ranging from detox and drug treatment to mental health counseling and housing. We are trying as hard as we can to convince our, our partners in state government that this is a, a deadly deadly public policy decision. A decision that comes at a difficult time for the state, with a massive deficit in COVID-19 costs setting up. According to Klemanski, providers like Helio Health were asked to cut back 20, even 30 percent. We're seeing massive spikes uh, in overdoses across the state, and we're seeing uh, spikes in suicides as well. Uh, so tremendous concern that at a time when the need is greatest, uh, and we have the, you know, threat of the COVID-19 pandemic, uh, to have funds withheld is just, it, it puts a, a tremendous strain on the behavioral health treatment system across the state. While Helio Health is still gauging the impact of the withheld funds, Glamansky worries if the federal government doesn't help New York, these temporary reductions could become permanent. It will force some of us, if these withholds uh, are carried into the fourth quarter, to evaluate reductions in services, um, possibly even layoffs uh, in some types of program settings or in extreme situations uh, for some of the more vulnerable programs there you, you could even be talking about program closures and leave many of New York's most vulnerable without the help they need in Syracuse Rob Hackford News Channel 9. Helio Health's programs, they are operating as usual, and Klemanski says despite these uncertainty and all of these strange times, there will always be someone to help. So if you are struggling with addiction, depression, or mental health, you can call 211.